Well, guys, the BBC have decided to put a little piece out on the Died Suddenly documentary that currently has 4 million views on Rumble and 1.5 million or more on Twitter. This documentary talks about the apparent large increase in reports of people dying suddenly, alongside reports of arm from the jabs that people at the BBC spent a good year covering up. This they did despite the world knowing all pharmaceutical medicines have side effects and new ones made within a year and rushed out will not be exempt from that. The media and government tried their best to suppress any reports of adverse effects for as long as they could but even now they admit it through gritted teeth. Well, sort of they do, they still don't fully acknowledge it but to be honest I highly doubt they ever will. Anyway, the point of this video is not going over the died suddenly video or anything like that, it's something you should all go and watch yourself. No, in this video I just wanted to point out not only the pure damage control being run by the BBC with this hit piece, but also the hypocrisy of the BBC, or in fact any media outlet calling it disinformation. I mean, for instance, how many times did the BBC say the jab was 100% effective? And how many times did they tell people to get the jab to protect others, despite the jabbed and triple jab still testing positive? How many other things did they lie about for two years that makes this hit piece a laughable bit of rank hypocrisy? But I guess the hit piece here does show that the powers that be are worried about the reach of this documentary, and let me tell you, it just keeps on growing. Where are